Welcome to my Sorcery Boss Beat Down difficulty ranking video. Starting with number one, the easiest boss to defeat with Sorcery is the Old Demon King. Why is he so easy? Well, because he basically can't hit you. He's very slow. You just dodge backwards and unless you do something stupid like trying to use different kind of magic like this he won't hit you at all there's really nothing he can do that was the only time he hit me in the whole fight and he shouldn't have hit me with that um, yeah he's very very easy Okay, the second boss might be a bit of a surprise, but Dancer of the Boreal Valley is very, very easy to kill when you're playing as a sorcerer. Um, at this point in the playthrough, you've probably leveled up quite a bit, so your magic is fairly strong. And uh, although the boss looks really, really cool, she just moves around the arena really slowly. And it's quite easy to dodge backwards, run around the arena, and uh, avoid all of her fancy spinny attacks, whilst at the same time hitting like 560 damage now. So, uh, again, she's another boss where I did it first time, and she only actually hit me once. So yeah, um, you've even got time to pull off some of your flashier, more high damage sorceries like uh, Soul Spear there. And um, as long as you keep on top of your Estus, keep your distance, really, she shouldn't hit you. So uh, that's why she's number two. at number three on the list is a guy who's a lot scarier than looking than he actually is to fight. Uh, High Lord Walnir. Okay, so I missed the dodge, but this guy only has a couple of places that you have to actually hit. Uh, as long as you use your Farron Flesh Sword, you'll take him out. No problem whatsoever. He only killed me once, so... That's why he's so low down on our playlist. I'm not sure if you can get in with that magic or not, but... There you go, that's all you need to do. He's a fairly easy boss. He's a belly easy boss anyway, but as a mage, he's not particularly difficult either. Okay, coming in at number four, Yorm the Giant. Another guy who only killed me once. And uh, surprising that he's actually very easy to kill with only magic, even with just a uh, strong soul arrow or Great Soul Arrow, whatever it's called. Um, the thing is that his head takes massive damage when you knock him down like this. And you can hit him for over a thousand just for just for that normal hit. Now sure, he has 28,000 health apparently, but that doesn't really matter if you're hitting him for like a thousand three hundred for one of these little Soul Arrows. So. Yeah, he hits hard, but... Um, very easy to dodge, so yeah. He's the fourth easiest boss to defeat with magic, even without using Storm Ruler. Coming in at number five on the list, and still in the very easy 
range of bosses is the Ancient Wyvern. Um, yes, I know this isn't the actual Ancient Wyvern. I know, I lost the footage. But Ancient Wyvern Jr. here does basically the same thing as the original Ancient Wyvern, so you get the idea. All you have to do is avoid the breathing fire attack, uh, stay underneath his head, zap, zap, don't hit the legs, hit the body or the head because it does more damage. Try not to get stomped on, but honestly it doesn't matter that much if you do get stomped on because it can't one-shot you. And just do this until it dies, so it's quite easy. And number six on our boss, sorcery boss rundown is the first boss in the game, Udix Gundir. You might have expected him a bit, a bit earlier on on the list, but um, no, this guy has a certain amount of difficulty as a sorcerer. He, he does rush you, he doesn't give you a lot of time. At first, anyway. And you have to fight him, obviously, with very limited resources. Ah, limited Estus, limited Ash Estus, limited spells, uh, limited armor, and obviously an unupgraded weapon, which means that the fight is actually quite challenging. I mean, it's, don't get me wrong, it's still not that difficult, but you can die, and I did die to this guy. But you shouldn't die. Coming in at number seven on the list. And uh, something that, I don't know, this fight, people people find this fight difficult. I, I don't. Um, they've only killed me twice ever. Once as a sorcerer, once as a knight. Um, as a sorcerer, especially in the second phase of the fight, it really wasn't that difficult. Key is, don't use slow magic. Use quick magic like Great Soul Arrow. And and obviously dodge around and wait for your opportunities. First phase of the fight is a little bit difficult, second phase of the fight is a little bit easy. It's still one of my favourite boss fights, because it just looks and sounds so cool, the music's fantastic. Um, but it's, dare I say it, a little bit easy. Honestly, I, I, I would even consider putting this one even uh, the, among the even easier bosses. But, yeah, all right. Yeah, they do have some challenge. I mean, they can certainly, they can certainly kill you if you're not paying attention. So I guess they deserve this spot. Right, that's all. I will continue this in another video. Okay, right. Number eight on the list is Board of the Boreal Valley. Uh, this guy. He did get me a couple of times, and I just had to, you know, get my timing sorted out, work out how much time I have to hit him with magic. I think, like, after getting him his time, I, I think I probably would get him most times, so he's not super difficult, but it's no shame in dying to him. Uh, you just gotta remember, dodge to the side when he comes charging at you, and when he uses his icy breath attack, then, yes, when he can go to town. Try not to get too close to him at this point either. There you see, when you're away from him, you can easily dodge him. Anyway, that is it for the top eight. Well, the bottom eight, I suppose. So in the next video, we'll look at the next eight. Getting into the slightly difficult bosses for the next video. So I will see you all on the next one. Thank you for watching.